friends and like uh, Brendan Shop had him on a uh, fighter and the kid and shit and he's just trying to fuck Bobby Lee's girl Bobby Lee's. yeah uh, I can see that she's yeah. hot what a douche she is hot for sure but yeah no man that's fucked up bro yeah let him have his that's bro code girlfriend right yeah cause it's Bobby Lee yeah right you, you really think Bobby, Bobby Lee's gonna come steal your girl if, if anything like I well, mean, he's an ugly motherfucker he is but the fact that he's she's with him fuck, dog. yeah He's just a weirdo, though. Probably the way he was on, he just had his rehab again, or probably, I don't know if he did it before or not, but... I like his, uh, molest... His, uh, being molested. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's like, yeah. He's like, don't laugh. <laughs> like, oh, when the... And then he tells, he tells, uh... That other Chauvin, kid, right? He, he tells the Chauvin fucking Brian Callen. Yeah. But, he's no, like, it's, it's when, like, the other kid, like, the 13-year-old kid or yeah, something, like, he's a... Like, Mentally retarded or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's like, oh, yeah, I, he's yeah. like, I was molested by uh, by uh, a guy with Down syndrome. And they just laugh. and then they laugh. He's like, don't laugh or I'm gonna leave. And yeah. then afterwards, he's like, I was. He's like, I'm gonna tell you guys again. I was brutally molested. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, like him and, and like, don't say brutally. Uh, like, come on. <laughs> well, him and Santino though, like they make a good. You know, like podcast together too. That's but, one of my favorites. I like yeah. Santino. Bad friends, yeah. Santino. He has like potential to like fucking yeah. kill it because he like he's pretty funny. Yeah, he's funny super though. fast too. He yeah, he agrees with everything and then like well, he's like the yes and kind of improv kind of yeah. person though. So yeah. he, whenever you start like joking about something, he just starts going with it. Him and Giannis Papas, yeah. dude, I think they oh, fucking, yeah. they should do a podcast together because I feel like they kill it. Have you listened to them do one together? Because Giannis does do oh. his podcast, Whiskey Ginger. Whiskey Ginger, yeah. I've yeah. been on, I've I've that, yeah. Cause he's had two on there, and I've listened to both of them. Actually, oh, they're good, yeah. They're he, fucking yeah. Giannis, dude. Him and Giannis, like, they fucking flow, dog. Giannis is fucking funny. Yeah, he's a good dude. He's probably one of the funniest dudes out there. Do you right listen to Long Days or no? No, I haven't listened to it. I, like, I have, I have less time to listen to podcasts now, so I don't oh, listen okay. to as many as I used to. It's but. it's all right, young long days. It's like eh, because he has that other younger uh, black dude, and I forget what his name is, but he's he's cool. But like, well, him, when him and DeStefano were doing fucking uh, oh, uh, the, history the hyenas, history hyenas, that was dude, that was right? one of my favorites. Like that shit was so yeah. funny. It was Stefano's so good. Fucking hilarious too. Oh yeah, dude. Why Shang Chen? That shit. Oh, man. <laughs> have you have you watched his special on Netflix yet though? Special Weshi? Nah, it's actually yeah, Special Weshi. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, that's DeStefano. Yeah. That's all the day, yeah, right all day yeah. Oh, I was like, there's a reason why she he got it. on Netflix and Brandon Shop d- did not. Like, oh. there, there's a big reason as well. Wait, but. isn't his... I thought his new special was on Netflix. Shops? Yeah, no, yeah. yeah. No, not not Shop's. Okay. Shop's not. No, his no? is on YouTube. Oh, yeah, Shop did a YouTube The Gringo release. Poppy is on YouTube. Really? I thought it was on That's Netflix. Why, yeah. I thought it was on Netflix, too. No. Why, why would they put that ass on fucking Netflix? No, it's not. Shows was it's not. Him out. I nope. Okay. Nope. I, I really thought it was Netflix. Actually... Actually, Chris DeSefano was going to put it on YouTube, but like literally last minute when he was on your mom's house, he was talking about how like his well, person hey, that put into it, <laughs> yeah, his person was telling him like, hey, can is there any way you can not do this like uh, thing with Tom Segura? And he's like, there's no way I'm not going to do this podcast with Tom Segura anyway. <laughs> but they Netflix ended up picking up like they, they didn't even have to edit it, no nothing. So Christina P is actually not that bad, though. I do not like it. Reminds it reminds you, though. So you said podcast. Yeah. A what podcast? Or Dude Smoothie's a podcast that we're on right now. Well, yeah. yeah. And you're listening to it. Yeah. Oh, we are, we're actually recording now? We're yeah. on a podcast talking about podcasts. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. like... 
Podception, dude. Yeah. Oh wow. So That's you're listening. We're in a podcast you're actually listening about podcasts. To dudes with yeah. Me. Which is not a podcast about other podcasts. <laughs> we podcast we just about to be other podcasts. Talking about podcasts. It could be. I think. Did you guys hear the last dude's movie? Because I think that was probably the best podcast I ever heard in my life. Man. Allegedly. Not allegedly. <laughs> allegedly. No. Not in this. Not in this instance. Allegedly. It's not allegedly. No. no. Most things I say are fact, and that was one of them. Yeah, like you're a model or something. Everything or I say is factual information. Yeah. If you uh, need to hear the truth about anything, I have it. You're you're the new Google. I just have to ask you about. Yeah. I'm like Doctor Fauci, dude. You can't question me. Yeah. Oh, okay. To question Daniel is to like question Google. Yeah. And I was talking about science. you, not Daniel. Uh, well, me too. To question oh, okay. me is I'm like, actually to more factual God, than Daniel dude. sometimes. Uh, I doubt that. No, one. This is, I'm always saying this is a face you can trust. Well, <laughs> Daniel can cry. He has the cure to cancer, but he just never cries. Yeah. His tears are. Yeah, his tears yeah. are the cure for cancer, but he just never cries. Yeah, so um, sorry about that. Has he seen the end of Titanic? <laughs> no, he hasn't. Then he'd cry. I've seen it. It's what? A movie. No, I never cried at that movie. I did cry. I did laugh hysterically. I did get teary eyed. I think we already talked about this. I, I got teary eyed at uh, Backdraft back in the day. I got I got yeah. teary eyed at Ratatouille. Ratatouille? No, Ratatouille. <laughs> Ratatouille? <laughs> What's Ratatouille? I don't know what that is. Look it up. Watch. Ratatouille? Well, the one that I said that I cried at one a long time ago was that um, when Baby G. Were you on the? Were you on that episode? Yeah, you yeah, yeah. Because I was the one that brought it up. Because I was we talking, about talking about how Louis J. Gomez was talking about a certain <laughs> what the fuck? scene that like he was knockoff. talking about. That it's a legitimate knockoff movie, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ratatouille. Was it? Really, it yeah, really was. Funny. Yeah, it's uh, a real movie. Like I'm not even man, joking. It's, it's a real like, movie. So I answered you with like the right thing, <laughs> Ratatouille, uh, but Ratatouille. Yeah, I mean, pretty much. They have a movie here called uh, Panda Fighter. Yeah, but it looks like. It's Kung just Fu Panda, Kung whatever. Fu Panda. It's, it's Kung Fu Panda. Yeah. It's all generic looking. Jiu Jitsu Panda. Yeah. Dude, they have, yeah, like this company does like all kinds of super knockoffs of these movies. You That's know hilarious. What I mean? nice. And yeah, this they have one. The Brave. Kiara the Brave is supposed to be like that. Uh, brave Heart. No, no, no. It's a. Uh, uh, I don't know. A chick with long hair. What was that? See, there's another Kung Rapunzel? Fu Panda. No, it's long red hair. Oh, yeah. I think that's called Braveheart. Guess what the is other Kung Fu... Is that one where she's like... I think it's just called Brave. Chop, chop, brave, chop, maybe? Yeah. This is called Brave. It's just called maybe brave. it's Brave, yeah. yeah no, was... okay, Braveheart is the other one. Yeah, no, it's, I yeah, think no, it's Brave. Braveheart one. is the one with Mel Gibson. Yeah, there cool, you go. Yeah, yeah. Cool Cat I'm saves down. the kids. Yeah. Dude, Cool Cat yeah, is a, a Christian dude. movie. I know. <laughs> He's like a Christian The only one mascot. with a degree and I'm dumb. Yeah, I know. Ratatouille got 1.6 on IMDb. Right. Dude, just... Ratatouille. Toing. That shit is so fucking funny. All those B movies like Albert would that like is to watch. Dude. Oh on Netflix. man, he'll, he'll those like are the find. Worst. I don't know if he like purposely seeks out the worst <laughs> looking movie possible. He's like, what's that movie? There was a movie, uh, a horror movie about a tire. Oh that yeah, kills yeah. People and shit. Like he'll watch shit like that. <laughs> what? That's, like, really? that's like my uncle because yeah. my uncle like, like Sharknado bullshit. He'll yeah. literally go to and find the worst uh, scary movie known to man, and he's like. We're gonna watch this because yeah. it was when I was younger too. Like, cause like I mean, back when, when I was younger, him. they were pretty bad movies. But like, yeah. they were just the ones that he would have me watch. I'm like, God damn! Did, like, you ever watch The Snowman? No. Such a stupid movie. That was the worst fucking movie. <laughs> was it like ever. Jack Frost, like a knockoff of Jack Frost? Or what? No, it, it was, was scary. Yeah. It's supposed to be a scary movie. A scary oh. Snowman, I mean, it, dude. It, yeah, well, like I thought there was a scary version. Jack Frost or whatever. It is. It's like a yeah. scary version, I would say. Not yeah. not the one with my, was it Michael Keaton or whatever. Yeah, it's not that, that a, not that, that Jack was a good Frost. Movie. Yeah. That was a good, all right, that's a, not that, not that one. You're talking about. No, no, no. There's another one that it's like scary kind of thing. <laughs> yeah, that's what he's talking about. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the Snowman, and the, it was yeah, literally but, but they were like in a cabin. Off. They were in a cabin. But oh. it's a rip off of that one with Michael Keaton. Oh, okay. Is what no, it is. I thought. Well, there was another one that was called Jack Frost that was like a scary one or whatever, whatnot. Uh, there probably was. <laughs> I'm sure there is. There's yeah, a lot of yeah. really bad movies that are scary yeah. out there. They got a they got a Hulk right. knockoff here called The Amazing Bulk. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The, yeah. The, that reminds me the of the Amazing uh, Chunk, dude. Yeah. Do you remember that? Chunkus. The Big Chunk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the uh, su- was it Nintendo 64? They had like claymation kind of fighting. Oh, clay fighters. Yeah, there you go. 63 to 30. Yeah. Or whatever it was. I think they, was. Didn't they have like a snowman in there too? That yeah, that was the main one of the main characters yeah. of the snowman, dude. Do you guys remember a, a PS1 game. game where there was like a mummy that would like stretch his arms out? 
It was a fighting game. Oh, I remember that. Oh, uh, I don't remember what it was called. I can't though, remember dude. what it was called either. But I had a dream about that mummy, like stretching his arms. Like he like walked past my window. You? Yeah, it, it almost... and he stretched his arms right up into my asshole, yeah. and it came out my mouth. It no. almost... <laughs> okay, Martin Luther King Jr. You like had a his, dream over here. His arms almost looked like like mechanical after they, as they stretched. As it yeah, like... but they would like un- unroll like two like like with like the mummy like toilet paper oh. shit like the... I don't I don't know maybe I'm thinking. <laughs> Bandages. We might be thinking of the same game. Just I don't know. I mean, I remember shit way differently. Remember Earthworm Jim? Yeah, this shit was tight. Yeah, everybody. When he uses his head remember. as a Earthworm fucking whip. Jim. Earthworm Jim was hard. Will you uh, refresh this? No. Please. Why are you paying attention to that? I'm so fresh that I gotta refresh. It's fight night, dog. It's big fights tonight. There's, There's fights. Is fight night. Charles Oliveira versus Justin Gaethje. We're about to fight over your butthole. Rose Namajunas. Fight, fight over your butthole? Versus Carla Esparza. What's inside your butthole? Yeah, where is going to win that one? Wow. Uh, <laughs> Tony Ferguson versus uh, fucking Tony. Uh, Michael you know Chandler. You know what, though? As a, I might do a nerdcore event, like actual event. And if I do, I'm going to have fucking some setups. And we're definitely going to have fight night, and I'm definitely going to have to whoop your ass. I'll whoop, uh, okay. I'll whoop your ass in any of them, dog. What's that? Now I'm so confident. Now. I don't know that I can't find this. Uh, oh, is it? No. Mummy? Is it uh, uh, what's that fighting game? Uh, it wasn't only Killer about Instinct? Mummy. It might be Killer Instinct. Was it maybe Killer Instinct? I don't know if it was it a Mummy character, but. It wasn't only about, it was like, there was just one Mummy character. Is there in Killer Instinct? I don't think there, I don't know. There might Wait, be. was Killer Instinct on PlayStation? I can't remember. I Are you know. even sure it was on PlayStation? I don't even know. Let me see. Like, How about you get out of his face, huh? Whoa. I think it was on uh, <laughs> Nintendo 64. Let me get sure. one of them, dude. And it was an arcade cabinet, wasn't it? It was a cabinet, yeah. It was on It was on um, 64, for sure. Uh, Super Nintendo. Cheers. Cheers. Beers. Cheers. Queers. Queers. Cheers for queers. But yeah. Queers. And Canelo's fighting tonight, boys. He's fighting. Steers and queers. Bivol. Bivol. Yeah, Your but it'll, it's going to be a couple days after I think it was on the PlayStation. Yeah. Well, I'm still going to make my prediction and we're going to all see if we're right, you know? Well, when it comes out, we'll see if you're right or not. Exactly. Yeah, oh, we'll, we'll see if I'm a dumb idiot or not. But, I mean, I know Canelo's going to win. Well, we already know you're a dumb idiot, but your prediction could be I right. am yeah. not a dumb idiot. kind of look like That's a dumb idiot That's not what Aurora says. You guys Ooh. are dumb idiots. Yeah, and, of course, she would say that. Of course. She's a dumb idiot. She takes after me. You're a dumb idiot. Oh, okay. You are. Look Surprisingly, though, I didn't realize how much she she actually listens or does the same things that I do. Kids it's are, crazy. It's, They're like sponges. Is, isn't it weird, like, how, like, uh, when you're, like, I've never raised a kid, but I've been around, like, well, yeah, me a too. kid growing up, you yeah. know? And, like, the shit that they, like, pick up on, it's, like, that's the weirdest shit. Yeah. That, like, I'm, like, how did you learn that? And yeah. it's just, like. Seriously, I when I was talking to my mom on the phone one day, and then she was w- repeating this TikTok that I watched. I didn't even know she was in the room. But she repeated the exact same thing, like, as I was showing Mark one day, and I'm like, what the hell? Yeah, what? <laughs> what? Like, what, what, I didn't even show you that video. How do you remember that? Isn't it crazy, like, when, like, kids are first learning to talk, and then they, like, uh, they Pick use up the something. words. In, well, they use something in a in the proper context. Yes. It's like, Jesus Christ. Like, you use that perfectly, but how, <laughs> how did you, you know to use that perfectly yeah, that what way? The yeah. Fuck? I have a dude at work that said that, too. He's like, you Babies use that word mind. exactly the way it's supposed to be, and I can't be mad at you using that word. It's a bad word. I'm but like not around kids But ever, how so. can you use yeah. that? Kids are fucking awful, dude. I hate kids. I don't know anything like, <laughs> really about them or nothing. <laughs> dude, they're like sponges, though. They will literally... And the thing is, is like, why is it they pick up on the things that they're not supposed yeah, to pick up Yeah, some weird, like, yeah. stupid stop, shit. Stop saying I'm cussing, you yeah. motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah, it's like literally I said every <laughs> single word the exact same way, but the one word that stood out to them is the one word that they shouldn't have yeah. picked up. Yeah. There's a story here. God, I'm looking at uh, the news. Rick Rick Ross questions the validity of crypto millionaires. So he says something like, "Y'all getting so much money? Where's it coming from? Or where are you at? Or whatever." It's like, dude, just because you don't understand it doesn't mean it's not valid. But it's it's just like the well, stock that's like market. Religion. Dog. Rick if everybody Ross if everybody pulled stupid. out at one time, yeah. nobody so just, would have money. He's just retarded. He doesn't get it. 
Dude, I don't understand. Just because he made his money off of music and Wingstop. Dude, if everybody <laughs> tried to pull out, though, pull out their crypto at Diggity. one time, there would be... Crash same it, with right? banks. There'd be millions. There'd be millions with uh without money. So yeah. it's, it's like, the yeah, same with that's banks. It's just like the stock market. Yeah. So it's like well, bank. Yeah, it basically ain't. It's not real money because it, it. It's all imaginary. Potentially couldn't be there. Yeah, you created at that, any certain yeah. time. Yeah. Like if you like say like everybody started pulling out and you're like, oh, let me get my money. You're like, oh, sorry, whoops. My friend, uh, apparently, uh, he's he's about to get out of prison. And uh, he bought like fifteen uh, bitcoins? bitcoins before it blew up. Oh, back in the day, like, like yeah, like fifteen years ago. He's a millionaire ago. now, dog. Yeah, I guess he's about to get out. He's about to be set when he gets out here. Soon. Well, of course, yeah. Let's see it. Let's link up. But he doesn't know. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't really know what to do or nothing. Right. He there's the people that did that, and then they only remember the password for some shit, and they're like, "Well, it's how like do that, I get to that?" It's like that motherfucker that uh, sold his bitcoin for pizza, and yeah, he, like, bought a. It, Right now, it'd be like a three point seven million dollar pizza. Right, <laughs> yeah. it's like, you dumbass. Yeah. I think it's like, right well, now I sold it. one bitcoin is like thirty eight thousand dollars. Well, we, I can and actually even, look that that's up. even on a dip right now because I think it's yeah. dipped right that's now. That's low right now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it, it's going up and down though. So yeah, we well, checked it the other day. It was well, at thirty eight. Yeah, but. shout out to Elon if he tweets. Yeah. I mean, he's gonna tweet. I can't. Oh, yeah, shit. We got to talk yeah. about that too. We we uh, we lost a lot of stuff. This is uh, obviously one of those another one of those episodes. Hey, we were gone for a while. Yeah. <laughs> uh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> we were gone for a while, but we have we have our reasons. It's yeah. not like we were just taking a hiatus. It's a life. hiatus. Mm-hmm. We're busy at work. People have been quitting. <laughs> so I've been working. Same with Mike. He's been working a lot too. Everybody's been working. I totally relate to Rihanna on that. Rihanna in front, dude. Rihanna. Her oh, yeah. savage, her, what is it, that lingerie or whatever? Goddamn. Oh, fuck. Uh, Chris <laughs> Brown just I was saying Rihanna, water. though. Like, she's the one that's been doing that shit. Was Remember it when Venti she wasn't and, fat? Venti and Rihanna's Savage. Rihanna's fat now? Yeah, she's got a well, kid. she had a kid in her belly. That's why he's saying she's uh, fat. Gross. gross. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't make that's mistakes, worse, so I don't have kids. Yeah. That's somehow worse than yeah. she's pregnant. Yeah. Man, that also reminds me Roe v. Wade got overturned. Oh, yeah. No, it hasn't it's, gotten it's overturned yet. It's trying there to was, be. It's not even It's so, not even bad. They're basically trying to it do was, it where state to state. It was yeah, the states have the right now. But it was basically uh-huh. a leak of a document that said it might be overturned here soon. Yeah. It hasn't been overturned. Everybody but I think they, they're still going to overturn it, though. I, like, I mean, I mean uh, if they're talking about it in, Emails, I guess they're gonna but probably do it. But there's uh, nothing bad about overturning it because all it does is just leave it up to state rights. Yeah, yeah just live in a blue state. I thought it was yeah. funny as hell. Or travel Lu- across state lines. Yeah, Luis J. Gomez has thought about yeah, it. You want to like, kill babies? Yeah. Go to Colorado. Yeah, yeah. come he's here. Like, we love killing babies. Yeah. <laughs> what is he's like? I'm 51 percent for abortions, but I'm 49 percent for pro life or whatever. Yeah. he's like, he's That's like, oh, so you're Congress? Too. Yeah, it's like, oh, if you want to have a baby, if you don't, but it's like. Some if people shouldn't have kids. Yeah, well, that yeah. makes sense. I but don't, sorry, go ahead. Sorry. I'm saying like my auntie was all talking about that. Like, well, every baby should be be born, and they should be about that. I'm like, okay. Yeah, what do you that, do with it? Okay, them, so it, what you do with it? Okay, how many people are going to actually adopt that kid that's going to be born? Not many. Yeah. Okay, if you're pro life, okay, Good, that bro. makes sense. Yeah. You're pro life. What's going to happen to that baby after it's born? It's crying. <laughs> about abortion he like, loves are you gonna, kids dude. are you gonna are you gonna have a crack baby as a I a, love the children yeah. save the children are you gonna have a crack baby as an adopted kid dude, no I just my thing is is like I'm thinking about those crack babies you know? <laughs> <laughs> like I think there'd be, a whole, over here. there'd be a yeah. whole lot more retards yeah if abortion was I mean, illegal like, I mean like like what kind of retard like down syndrome oh or yeah like, no actual just dumb retards. kids like, yeah. yeah actual retards yeah, well, yeah. There's yeah a, well imagine the quality I mean, what's the quality of life of that I mean your quality of life immediately goes down for the next uh, 60 years because you're a kid because you have to watch you're dependent on he's you. a kid he's uh-huh. a kid for fucking 60 some, years some of those people though they're not they're, they can actually be independent yeah but it's like it's rough yeah it takes a long time it, to it get depends on years. it depends on the level of it oh well, yeah because well, there's mean, definitely like they're, yeah, no, there's definitely retards. You got, your, you got your your at home retards and you got your working <laughs> retards, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Which one, when you the have a retard, walkers. you want to get a working retard. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Now, yeah. what I, I got work. in the back here is a couple of working retards. That hell do I owe it? Oh, wait, yeah. wait, wait. We got that Down Syndrome wait, we model, right? Here? We got a Down Syndrome model now. I thought you were just throwing Victoria a Victoria's Secret. Now it's just, oh, okay. No. It's right here. So oh, that Victoria's Secret Down Syndrome? 
Yeah, she's got Down syndrome yeah. and she's, she's hot. In yeah, yeah, I would say, is it so wrong? I, that I, she's see, I have never game? seen a she's picture. Of, I've never seen a picture of her, but all right, look. Yeah. Type in okay, okay, okay. It, hold on, would hold you, on. Would you guys fuck a retard? Hold on. <laughs> Let's put it this way. Look, the only problem yes. with fuck. <laughs> I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I have. That's the only the problem. Yeah. I've already fucked a bunch of retards. Yeah. Yeah. The only problem with having sex with this girl is the fact that she's going to definitely write your name in poop on the fucking mirror. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Amber Heard. That's like crazy retarded, though. Yeah. What about, I'm talking more like uh, just the mind of a child. Retard, so, like like a kid that has this the but, brain of a crow or something. Like. Uh, see, that right, makes so, it sound weird though. She's not a child. Yeah, that's gross. Ew. First, you pervert. You're a pervert, dog. Prevert. 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 Uh, let's revert. <laughs> <laughs> Back to what I said. Let's like rewind that. Would you? Would you reverse guys, that? So say this Victoria's Secret model. Oh, yeah, say hot she retard. I'm she obviously has a Victoria's fucked up face. Secret. Obviously, I, I could already tell that she has a fucked up I don't know. Face. They say that she's pretty hot, so I but don't know. I say she, to there's probably a reason a why. Say she has a great body. Are you fucking this bitch? Hot retard. Hot retard. <laughs> <laughs> and, and culture pops up. <laughs> culture. <laughs> she's the second fucking shit. She's Look not up. even hot. Victoria, <laughs> Victoria's <laughs> Secret Down Syndrome. <laughs> if you're going to look up the term... <laughs> Oh shit, that's funny. I like how Tropic Thunder's up there. Yeah. What the fuck? Well, you never go full retard. That's yeah. fine. Oh, uh, there is literally a Jennifer thong. Anson, I like there is shoes. a thong right there. That they, there's a thong. It just says sexy, sexy retard. retard. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> Those look like comfortable shoes. Yeah, that is hilarious. So, sexy retard. Hot retard, retard doesn't really bring up anything. Yeah, Victoria's Secret model retard. Okay. Yeah, no, you got to put it Victoria's Secret Down Syndrome. Yeah, maybe. Well, don't, yeah, oh, I think no, retard's not the, the the term that we're supposed to be using anymore. Yeah, dude, dude it's dumb dumb. I got a. <laughs> I actually <laughs> dumb dumb. This chick that I was the talking very first to. Picture. This is her? Yep, right there. There you go. Oh, yeah, this yeah, we got she's her. got yeah. nice titties. Can I, a, can I get a picture of this? Can I see this? I don't, I don't have no view on this. Let me see her face. Yeah, I like her her milk her uh, chocolate milk tits. That okay, she clearly has definitely down squirt out milk, by chocolate she milk. Smiles. She's pretty hot. She's hot. Would you fuck her? Hell yeah, I'd titty fuck the shit up. Well, I could probably get a titty fuck her. Does her boobs are retarded? Yeah. As soon as you take yeah. out the Lego pieces out of her vagina, you can definitely get it, <laughs> yeah, I promise. Yeah. She's yeah. like, I've been saving these for later. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and then she, and then she just shits applesauce. <laughs> <right there. laughs> Damn, okay. Man. Joe's like, fuck, I know what I'm jerking off to. This later. retard is hot. Yeah, what a hot fucking retard. Joe's definitely jerking off to that later. So let's look up. Yeah. I already got a boner. I'm using my phone. Track to he just, he's just got a Down boner. Down syndrome phone. woman. Do you think like uh, uh, Down syndrome dudes have they almost look hogs? Asian. Do you think they have hogs on them? It's possible. What, I mean, at retards? least one of those dudes has to have just a, a big huge fat fucking like a crazy dick, hog. Dude. It's like the size of a fucking Arizona tea can. Do you think these 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 <laughs> retards are just slinging their retarded dick? Yeah, dude, they got it. giving it to all the tards that they uh, are in class with. Yeah, you know those <laughs> one <laughs> or their handler. Yeah, see, he's like, you never see a trouser snake. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> for good bitch. What's a trouser snake? Yeah. Ooh, what's a trouser snake? So you gotta find a hooker Ooh. and ask her how many Down syndrome. Dudes, she's had sex with. I wonder how many. Well, the had. one that I had last week said one. She's like, This is my first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're the retard. Did you ever listen to Miss Pat, though, when she talked about her retarded uh, uncle Pat. or something like that? How she ha- helped her retarded uncle have sex maybe, or something like that? Maybe well, I've never heard those stories. Yeah. That sounds weird. I don't think yeah. I've heard those. It's weird and perverted. She's like, I think it was her uncle. I think I'm what, I don't know. Don't quote me on this. I think it was her uh, uncle she Cecil, though. Girl, actually. Her uncle Cecil is the one that she yeah, helped on, out she's with. She's a that. retarded little girl. Leave, stop looking at. Sorry, her. I gotta get off this. This is gonna. Be, I'm gonna be on some weird watch yeah, list. The cops yeah. are gonna come here now. Yeah. Five, but, uh, four, three, yeah. two. Fucking Miss Miss Pat talks about that on one of her girl. episodes. Yeah, she's like, Sorry. yeah, we helped out my uncle. He did. He he's. She, I guess um, someone yeah, in her family would buy a prostitute. To help him out, and she'd have to actually put it inside the like she'd help his her uncle. How could the prostitute not help with that? I don't. I don't know. Yeah, she's literally getting paid, oh, right? <laughs> Wouldn't you think that? But I guess uh, she fucking Pat was talking it in about there that. and kept yeah. it thumb. Yeah, like she right? was just standing there like this. Yeah, yeah, she, you know? She's like really into people doing incest. It's, yeah. I guess, but yeah, that's, that's what Miss Pat was. All, she was talking about that how she'd help out her uncle. She had her thumb in his ass right on the prostate so that way he stayed hard. And that's that's exactly. why she was there. 
Uh-huh. So yeah. Listen here, you stupid bitch. Miss yeah. Pat's got some crazy stories. Fuck yeah, she does. That bitch got shot in the titty. Yeah. She's She's so she don't have a nipple. Funny. She's so fucking funny. Uh, for a female, yeah. So would you suck on that titty that doesn't have a nipple? No, nah, I wouldn't suck on it either way. You would you not on Miss Pat? She's a she's a good sized lady. Shit, bro. I'm good. I go to town Especially on with Pat. with the way that her co-hosts <laughs> on her <laughs> podcast talk about her, it's like. She's like, oh, my pussy stank. It's like, oh. See, you walk all day, so you definitely got time to listen oh, to Oh, yeah, a lot of, of course, podcasts. yeah. I can listen to podcasts almost yeah. eight hours <laughs> a day. Because yeah. I was doing the That'd same nice. thing, essentially. Well, no, I wasn't that. doing... The podcast about podcasts. I wasn't yeah. doing... Do <laughs> Here like we go dude, again. Dude smoothie. I wasn't yeah. doing, like, your job, but I was walking, like, 10 to 12 miles a day. So, yeah. like, I was listening to podcasts eight hours a day. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep. You know, I, I don't do that anymore. Mine's about half the day, though. The, well, unless my friend calls me. And then she she takes up half the time or whatever. But then I usually talk to Montoya most of the day. All I know is your coworker that comes into my neighborhood is a dick. Oh, I don't even know who that is. I know. I'm just saying. (laughs) Most male men are dick anyway, or male carriers, I I should say. Normally cool as fuck. This guy's a dick though. My male guy, he literally. Uh, he he didn't like, want to go up to the door because he didn't shovel the sidewalk because yeah. he's a pussy. Yeah, he's like, I'm not. He's like, if you guys don't have this shit shovel tomorrow, I'm not walking up. And it's like, like it's like those people that okay, I don't care about mail, you dumb bitch. Yeah. <laughs> it's like those people that <laughs> like, going. Going. I'm, not go- I'm not going <laughs> to deliver your mail because I got to step outside of the vehicle. It's Who like, has paper bills uh, anyways, dog? I don't have paper bills. My shit comes old people, in email. Old people. Do. I'm not an old person. Walk past my house. Fuck you. <laughs> He's like the only the only mail I got yeah. delivered in my house. Amazon he, will be there. He said the only yeah, mail I get I is the ones that just fucking advertise to me. The only mail that he gets is the one that's in his ass. Oh yeah, that's true. Fuck that guy, dude. <laughs> anyway, <it. Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, man, I get heated up against about mailmen, dude. Yeah. I fucking hate you, Josh. So. <laughs> yes, for that's for different reasons, but I'm sure the mailman doesn't help anyway. No, I'm just playing, dude. I I don't have any problem with mailmen, dude. Male women though. Are uh, the trannies? Yeah. Male women? Yeah. Male women. They I thought you like. I thought you like getting it in the booty they with a male woman fighting in combat sports. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Speaking of combat sports, uh, Shogun is fighting Ovin St. Prue right now. Um, it's a big fight for Shogun because he hasn't fought in a while. Reminds me of that time that dude asked me, he's like, do you watch sports? I'm like, not really. He's like, are you a man? Yeah. I'm like, okay, so I have to be into sports in order to be a man? That is the craziest thing. Like, uh, they do like, they like test your man by like knowing what sports sports you watch. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you like watching a bunch of fucking sweaty dudes smother a ball. I'm like, cool. Yeah. Each other. It's uh, like, uh, yeah, so I have to be, in order for me to be a man, I have to be into sports? Yeah, I, I was told I was whack because I didn't watch baseball, uh, and I think it's fucking gay. Yeah, baseball sucks. Baseball's gay. I have this dude at work, <sighs> though, like, he literally, all he does is talk <laughs> no, about not. sports, this but awesome. he does the betting and all that shit, too, though, so. but he he, fights tonight. He makes a lot of money off of that shit sometimes, but, you know, of course, he... Doesn't my, always. My brother keeps hitting me with everything that he like wins on. He like he's like, oh, I just won this, won this. I'm like, goddamn, dude. I always have. I don't watch enough baseball to be fucking be able to win two hundred right. bucks every other day. Like, I always hate that awkward moment though I when you're wearing some actually. kind of sports team and then there, someone comes up to you and starts talking about them and I'm like, uh, I don't know anything. Or I'll just be like, yeah, sure, uh huh, yeah. yeah. Like, what do you think about that new trade that they just got? Yeah. I'm like, uh, I just well, wear. I it wear, is what it is. I wear Rocky jerseys, and anytime somebody says something about me to the Rockies, I'm like, I love the Rockies, but fuck the owners suck. <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah. and, and then, then they're like, oh my god, you're so fucking right. And it's like, yeah, dude. That's all you have to know about the Rockies. Yeah, that's what they suck at. Is that the Rockies maintaining Rock- a team? Yeah, it's like uh, it's like oh yeah, I love the Rockies, but man, they'll never be anywhere. And they're like, yep, yeah. oh fuck, and then they'll go on, yeah, fucking three hours. Those dudes that are really into sports, I'm like, yeah, cool, yeah, uh-huh. sure. Uh-huh. yeah, yeah, sure, yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. totally, yep, right. yep, totally. Uh-huh. Yeah, how about yeah, yeah, sure. right here? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, how about the Yankees? Yeah, uh-huh. yeah, right. I'm like, I just wear it because it's... it's how about that Derek Jeter, yeah. right? How about, yeah, yeah, yeah. how about the Biracial angel avalanche, though? Oh, that's Derek pretty crazy Jeter. that that's, that's what it Derek uh, Jeter. After so long. Biracial angel. Yeah. You shot Clipper. me. Derek Jeter, you shot me. You shot me. You dick. <laughs> He's a biracial angel. 
That's me. I that's had money on me. that game. That's my that's my rap name, Biracial Angel. Oh yeah. <laughs> Look out for my nice. new album. It's coming out next Cinco de Mayo. It's coming out. Yeah, just like Tom. That's Spurs. a whole year coming now, everywhere. Dog. Yeah, 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 dog. Yeah, he's got to have time to prepare for it. I just dropped my newest album on Cinco de Mayo, so I can't. We're done promoting that Cinco one. Cinco de Drinko. Yeah, I saw a meme that it was. Uh, it said "Happy Birthday, Mexicans," and I think that was the best thing. I, the best joke I saw about Cinco de Mayo. Happy birthday, Mexicans. Yeah, because <laughs> <laughs> like nobody got me a fucking present. Because <laughs> Because, like, you always see, like, the shitty memes and shitty jokes <laughs> yeah. about Cinco de, or Cinco de Mayo. <laughs> that was really funny. And then it, was, it, just said, it just said, happy birthday, Mexicans. <laughs> Common misconception. <laughs> Do you know what Cinco de Mayo is? It's yeah. when the, they drove the French out of Mexico City. Yeah, it's the Spanish had just made that, uh, what is it? The, the Mexicans. It's a war. No, I agree. Yeah, the Mexicans had won a war Mexicans. against the... The French. It's French. And it's a, it I just explain that. Yeah. yeah. Stop stop explaining what I just explained. <laughs> See, oh, yeah, the whatever. French dudes were stealing all their memes and shit, yeah. right? And yep. the Mexicans were like, yo, bro, that's totally not no, chill. No, dude. they didn't say that. They said, yo, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that's, well, that's not nah, chill. They didn't say. say that. They were like, oh, that they win. <laughs> America hey, just man, take it as cool. a way to, it's, it's just a way hey, to, cool. Americans take to drink tequila a lot. During that day, anyway. Yeah. Well, yeah, dude, they're stealing my my culture. Dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're appropriating. For fucking St. Yeah. Patrick's Day, they're Tequila. culturally appropriating St. Patrick's Same Day. Same thing, yep. yep. Tequila is fucking gross, dog. Because it's not Mexico's Independence Wrong. Day, like a lot of people think. Yeah, they, they, isn't there Independence Day on like September seventeenth? Okay. Or dis, is it seventeenth or fifteenth? You're. Are you sweating on your back? Because it's looking a little extra wet. Um. Yeah. <laughs> because yeah. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> You know, you remember, you remember Flash from the from DC. It's like I'm like that, but with coming. And oh, nice! Yeah, I, it's so. in September, though. I know for sure. Wait, wait, you come fast? Yeah, on his back. Oh, right on his back. Yeah, yeah. It, yeah. he comes yeah. back. So you're a different kind of wet bag, huh? Yeah, he's a wet bag. He's a wet bag that come back. I have a dream that one day they'll call us dry bags. Oh, <laughs> nice, dude! I have a dry bag, and every time somebody smacks me, it itches. So I hate it. I wish I was a wet bag, dude. <laughs> it hurts worse when it's wet. Dude, Tedward's being stupid cute in my lap. He's adorable as fuck. It's because he wants the attention. He wants to play with the cord. Yeah. He was that way when I just Hello. came in earlier. Giggity. Hey, Mikey. Uh, allegedly try crack streams. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> allegedly try this other one. <laughs> uh. That's the thing that'll cancel us. <laughs> allegedly. <laughs> but he said allegedly, though, so yeah. We're, yeah. we're covered. Yeah. Hey, the actually, the best meme that I've seen, though, with the Amber Heard and Johnny Depp one. Oh, was shit. I forgot that was going when on. She, when she had talked about ha- him having a jar of cocaine. Yeah, the, and then I they got show, a jar of tech. Yeah, he's got a jar of cocaine. It's like, okay, yeah, who has a jar? But then they, go, they show that part when he has a jar of dirt in uh, Pirates, Pirates of the Caribbean. He's like, found it. <laughs> Do you guys think that uh, Amber Heard has any chance of winning this fucking oh, hell trial? no. Uh, have no, you guys seen done. anything on it? Yes. She's done. Because she's a woman, that'd be the only reason. You think that's the only reason? Did you I don't see? Think, I don't Did you see her? She, maybe. She's putting on a great fucking show, though. Yeah. Dude. Did you see her take a bump nah, at, on, st- on well, Okay, stereo? who takes think. a bump off of a fucking napkin, yeah, dog? I mean, it looks... It to, it, it's pretty... It blends in. Yeah. Luke Jacob is like, no one fucking does that, you fucking amateurs. Louis J. guys said that. Yeah, I yeah. mean, but he, she does. I love Louis it's J, like, so it's I'd pretty. Cl- it looks like just like that though. Like she. Well, really she does snort that. up. I'm like, why yeah, are you snorting like up? It's yeah. Strong. Who has a who has a napkin up? I mean, a. Uh, <laughs> yeah, if you have a, a tissue, boogie, you, if you have a boogie, yeah. you blow it. But maybe she's not. She's not trying to be like gross. Okay, but once she takes the, the <laughs> tissue, even though she shit on a fucking bed. <laughs> once yeah. she, <laughs> she takes the tissue away, though, she rubs their nose with her actual finger. Like, why wouldn't she just? She take rubs the, the fucking tissue. Yeah, she's on her ass. She's all rubbing her gums and shit. She's all rubbing her gums. Okay. Yeah. You just you just supposedly blew your nose, but then you take the the tissue down and then you wipe your with your hand. She said, "Sorry, uh, sorry, sir, I have to go take a shit." Yeah. <laughs> and then her lawyer was objecting his own shit. That was funny. Yeah, that was actually pretty funny. But objection. objection. It, hearsay, dude. They objection, fuck, hearsay. They yeah. fucked I did their a, own shit up, dog. I did a jury duty 
and uh, duty. Oh, this was at J D. Yeah, I did it, and they selected me, and they legit like it was like. So they they brought this cop up, I was and he that. was saying uh, he was like he was saying some shit. I can't remember. It was, it was a while ago, but like any any opinion that you have on your on the stand, it's objection hearsay. Yeah. Because it's like it's like oh it's like he it's just what he says like so he's like hearsay, so like I don't know dude like it's so stupid. That's what the guy that the guy that was the defense like the he wasn't the prosecutor but he's the what is it just the what is that what is the other lawyer called it's not the prosecutor but the just the defense defense the defense lawyer yeah, yeah he killed it because like he got this dude's sentence like for us like he like got the like he convinced us that. It was like a lesser charge because, like, he like was trying to go for like not guilty, but then like he knew that he was losing, so he was like lesser charge. So the dude only got like two months when it would have been like four years. Damn. And he convinced us all, and I was just like, I, I'm not about to send another black man to jail. <laughs> 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 I'm not gonna be part of the problem. Yeah. Even though the guy was stupid as hell. Yeah. He he fucking sped off in his auntie's car or some shit. And then he turned himself in, and now he's saying not guilty. It's like, you're dumb as shit, dog. I can talk about it now since it's over, right? I don't know. I don't think you're supposed to talk about it at all. I'm not going to tell him. Fuck it. it Allegedly. I think once he's done It's settled. It's it's been settled. This Uh, book that I read. Allegedly, though. Yeah, supposedly, there's a scenario that I thought of that is exactly this. Yeah, that was all in my head. I don't live in... uh, Yeah, right there. Oh, damn. I won't talk about it. I know you fools are done smoked the whole goddamn thing, anyways. I know. I'm actually gonna stone. I I don't really get stoned during podcasts. I know. I'm surprised you hit it. To be honest. Yeah, that's crazy. Wow. So yeah, Dave, Dave Chappelle got attacked see by that? a SoundCloud rapper, right? You see that? Mother- yeah. yeah, he was a rapper. You see that no, motherfucker they- afterwards? Yeah, they beat the shit out of him. He just went to. He just went to court. Shit, he went dude. to court today. Was he all? He had, uh, he's getting charged with three misdemeanor misdemeanors misdemeanors. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah. No he, felonies. No, no. He should have got felony assault. Yeah. But I think. Well, they had a weapon. But on, it was in California. Like a bandit kind uh, of. California loves. It's in California. They love criminals there. Yeah, and they're like, you know what? Fuck this black guy, and let's just you know. <laughs> They don't what like, was they, supposed to they happen, love, though? Like, they love criminals and they hate black guys. What the fuck or was love, the aim yeah. of him doing that, though? Like, that's and he didn't question. even really take him down that It's hard. clout. Did you did you see what Dave Chappelle said afterwards? He said, he, said, look, he, said, luckily that, he, he said, luckily that uh, that was clumsy as fuck. Yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> he, like, he, he like walked up on stage and like tripped and then tried to tackle yeah. him. So. Well, like, I don't know. Dave Chappelle didn't even go down. He's fuck. His hips are good. <laughs> he <laughs> yeah. jumps real, like, real soon. You see him, and he, like, leaps, and be- he's got his legs and feet off of the ground before he even makes contact. Do you, th- do you so think he- it was just for his, like, sorry to interrupt you, Mark. No, you good. Do you think it was uh, to promote his SoundCloud rapping? No, Probably. I said that- Mikey, get in here if you're going to say something. Mikey's in the background trying to talk nonsense to us. <laughs> yeah, I heard an article say fucking um, that he was trying to wear, make awareness for his fucking auntie or something like that because she's homeless. What does that have to do with Dave Chappelle? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. That's, that's what the article I read. That really? That's it? That's just... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Supposedly he's a Mike. trans... Thank you, Michael, for your input. <laughs> but he also has a song about Dave Chappelle, or supposedly... Yeah, it's called... It's I think it's called Dave Chappelle, yeah, isn't something it? Like that, yeah. He's like, I'm gonna tackle Dave yeah. on the fucking stage. <laughs> on this, yeah, on this date. Oh my God, them was bars. Yeah. I mean, you know, I'm a secret rapper, in case you didn't know. The crazy, th- <sighs> the crazy thing is, it's like, why would you do that? For that reason, though, or why would you do that in the first place? For clout. But it's like he's trying to, like Mikey said, he's trying to bring awareness. But you gotta know that you're gonna uh-huh. get fucked up as soon as you get up there. You gotta know security is gonna okay. take your ass and beat the shit out of you. You the, gotta know that. The crazy fact, though, is that I think he got more fucked up than he would have ever realized in his life. I mean, he did get fucked up. Old boy's arm was turned backwards. I mean, I don't that feel sympathy for up. him. I don't, I don't feel sympathy for it. 
because that shit's stupid as hell. Yeah, that was a stupid move. You play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, I had like 30 people just took turns beating his ass. Wasn't it Jamie Foxx and background. Busta Rhymes? Or is it, I know Jamie so, Foxx for like sure. I think, I think Dave Chappelle was think trying Buster to... Rhymes was there. Dave Chappelle was trying to save them, but uh, supposedly... I know Jamie, Jamie Fox Fox, Buster Fox, Busta Rhymes, and John Stewart were stomping him. John, John Stewart, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're stomping this dude the fuck out. Yep. But uh, uh, Dave Chappelle said they had no involvement in it. Well, uh, I know. I think to save their careers yeah. and save yeah. like their money and shit. I know for sure at least Jamie Fox because he the dude. Oh boy, walked was up there with like the that, sheriff because yeah. he Jamie Fox had a cowboy hat on. You see the video? Yeah. No, he runs up on stage. He has a cowboy hat on, trying to chase oh. this motherfucker out of there. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I just I know the dude talked about Jamie Fox, so that's I know for sure it was him. But supposedly, I guess they held him down to, and supposedly they're saying Dave Chappelle actually went in there and kicked him too or something. Yeah. That's what uh, these fools ever preach for. Like this is old school hip hop right here. Yeah. I I seen a video of Dave Chappelle fucking saying, "Yeah, I just stomped the motherfucker backstage." Yeah, no, 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 no. He said they were stomping the motherfucker well, backstage. No, no. He said, uh, "On my no, ears, watch I was, the, he's rewatch like, the video." He's like, I, I was doing some rapper shit. First time I ever uh, stopped the motherfucker backstage. <laughs> or something he like didn't. That. He didn't yeah. go backstage though. If you watch the video, because people were get yeah. people actually got pissed off about like because they thought that Dave Chappelle said that. Well. He didn't. He didn't stop nobody. Well, he, he supposedly a, has those bags too that you're supposed to put your phone into. So, like, why did they have actual? Well, it was a comedy festival. Too. He he doesn't he doesn't control it on a comedy. Yeah. Okay. Festival. Yeah. Because when he came to the Springs, I guess he had those bags too mm-hmm. that you're supposed to put your phone in. Really? Mikey yeah. allegedly try crap. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know how much those tickets were though to go see him when he was at the Pikes Peak Center? Uh, I I bought I was about to buy it uh, the day it went on sale. Yeah, two hundred bucks. Yeah, it was like three hundred dollars for two hundred bucks for a decent seat, not yeah. even balcony seating. That's nope. ridiculous. Yeah. Wow. So when I heard that, it was like that much. Well, it was already sold out by the time I was thinking about getting them too. But I'm like, yeah, I like him, but not that much. When I went what? to buy it, it was, they were still on sale. Yeah, but it was it was you, literally two hundred dollars. That's the, that's too the, much. Do you think though that the whole Will Smith thing with Chris Rock has set this like precedent to where, oh well, I don't like what this dude's saying or something, so I'm gonna fucking, eh. I don't, I'm gonna try to decide what he's saying. Be I don't, unreal. I don't eh. think, I don't think it's even that. I think it's uh, the fame that they're about to get. That's not the right one, Mikey. Just clap. Uh, <laughs> I think, I, I think it's the fame that they're about to get because like this dude that attacked Dave Chappelle, his face, even how busted up it is. Has gotten he's gotten so many views now. Well, of course. So like, think about like these TikTok motherfuckers that like, cause like you know like they had like that whole like fucking fuck up your school challenge or some shit for these little kids. What? <laughs> yeah, I think I do remember that. Yeah, they I had like a. About this. Oh, had, TikTok. They pulled so it down. TikTok, yeah, I think they pulled it down right away. Yeah, but there was like that whole like there was like that challenge where it was like fuck well, up your school. Done. Yeah, yeah, so I think they might just do like yeah. some little, like quick quick clout. Yeah, these little ass kids that like. Already probably already crazy. They got fucking issues. They're gonna yeah. fucking issues. Well, They're I guess Mitchell got shot up the other day too. Yeah, they did. Yeah. Well, it was next to their student or something like that. Yeah. The cops. I just saw a story on it. Uh, two. I think the cops shot him. Oh, said two juveniles shot in a police. Well, uh, I mean that's because that's where my uh, cousin's kid goes to. So like I heard firsthand kind of most of the stuff that was going on. But it makes sense. It was two kids. Two kids did get shot at it, but I don't think it was the cops that shot him. It was the shooters. They end up getting the shooters too, but yeah, the shooters, the shooters, Schusters, the Schusting. Let the Schusting well, begin. The Schusting now. And yeah. then my auntie was all freaked out because she's like, "Is this the world that we live in?" And I'm like, "We've been living in that world since I was in high school." Yeah, it's always been that uh, It's always been that way. I was like, I mean, I guess when I was at the club one night and they shot it up, I wasn't freaked out about it, but everybody else was. But I'm like, I saw the dude just shooting it in the air and trying to just dick swing is pretty much what he was trying to do. Do you know those places get shot up the most? What? Anywhere that's gun, gun free. I'm not saying, uh, I mean, yeah. why, what is the officer there for? Like the school liaison? Yeah. That's why they have the cop Gun there, free right? zone, yeah. But, like, they never seem to, like, do their job or whatever when the shit goes down. It's because they're lazy, and they, they already know that job is going to be cake. So they're like, oh, it's a it's a gun free zone and everything else. So I was like, I'm just going to take it easy. Yeah. Like, even Joe Rogan was talking about that when he was a security guard. Like, he's like, oh, 
I'm out of here. Oh, uh, when shit goes down? Yeah. Yeah. They're not going to be the one. No, even, like, in anybody but it's in a cop, that though, like, Cause it was like, what was the one in Florida? I think they actually charged the cop because he no. didn't, like, go and, like... Protect and serve like he's supposed to? Yeah. Oh. I don't know. It's, it does happen pretty frequently. Yeah. It'd be scary to have a kid right now. Oh, yeah, definitely. I'm, because it's like, I don't have any, uh, I guess, like... Any what would the boot board kind of thing be like? I don't have anything in the game, so like I'm not worried about it. But like when I found out they had a shooting there, I'm like, he ain't even close to that shit. They're not going to shoot him, so like, yeah, he's gonna yeah. be fine. But I guess that like if it was my own kid, I'd probably be freaked out. So right, you know, I don't know. Yeah, shit's fucked up. But like I said, what's, like, what's your I, favorite school shooting? <laughs> what the fuck? Favorite one? I'll go there's, first. Sandy Hook. I'll say there's there's only a couple that are actually big, like you know Columbine, Sandy Hook, and I mean you don't really know any more after that. But we don't remember that Amish kid here. shot up a school in Pennsylvania. Amish? Well, I'm assuming oh, wait, he was uh, in Pennsylvania. What was it? That one? Yeah, he had a loaded fucking musket. Dude. He's a Mennonite. Oh, the Virgi- Virginia Tech shooting, too. Oh, the Asian yeah. dude with yeah. the double Glocks? I, uh, yeah. I actually have Mennonites in my family, dude. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's because you're so white. Oh, I'm crazy white. And yeah. uh, they came to visit, dude. And the the fucking the, Is it weird? I had cousin. I think they're my cousins? I don't isn't, know. Isn't that a character on uh, Smash Bros.? What, a Mennonite? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he, Moon Knight. Meta Knight. Yeah, he did. I thought, de- it, I he thought de- it was Meta Knight. Knight. Men- Isn't it Meta Knight? Men- oh, Knight? there is Meta Knight. Yeah. He's like, I will yeah, attack right. you with my fireplace. He's got, like, the <laughs> wings, and he looks like a like a super yeah, dope Kirby, Kirby or something. Yeah. 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 It's from Kirby. No, that's Moon Knight. That's what Moon Knight no, looks Moon like. Knight. I thought it was Moon Knight. Moon Knight is a Marvel Meta movie. Knight looks like idiot. a regular-ass dude, almost. Yeah, here, I'll show you. From Men- or Nintendo? No, Meta Knight is actually the... Uh, Alter of Moon Knight is what it is. I'm pretty Moon Knight sure. is oh. a Marvel character. Every time I, I, I was just like, whenever I hear Meta Knight, though, I always think of that. Yeah, Meta Knights are that. they're uh, di- oh, they're diet they're diet Amish. I'm all over the place. Yeah, they're they like have electricity shit. Yeah, because they can like because uh, they pulled up. So when when I first met them, I was like like nine, ten. How much people? Oh. Well, no, they were they're Mennonites. So they they pulled up in this like fucking Aren't- '98 Toyota Corolla. Fucking stacked to the <laughs> brim, dog. Aren't Meta Knights yeah. Amish or no? No, they're basically Amish. Kinda. They're diet Amish. Yeah, like diet. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll yeah, say Shane Gillis was talking about that on uh, Theo Vaughn's thing. That's why I was wondering. Yeah, they yeah. They can yeah. have, like, some stuff. Yeah, so they like, pulled they, up in a Corolla, yeah. but then, like, when they pulled up, uh, my I think they're my cousins, basically. Mm-hmm. the My male cousin, I can't remember his name. Mm-hmm. I'd, Probably Jedediah. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremiah, Jedediah, yeah. yeah. Somehow their last name was Smith. Oh, Obadiah, yeah. But, uh... And then the other... Yeah, he, he was wearing... He was literally wearing, like, a straw hat. Like, it's, like, literally what you would think... Yeah, they think, make their own shit, right? It, it's literally what you would think uh, an Amish dude would look like. Was Rump what he looked like. Yeah. He was wearing overalls, and he had the shirt on. And then the girls were wearing the bonnets and the dresses. <laughs> and they were looking at my sister... Crazy, cause she's wearing jeans. Of course. Yeah. And I had just woken up, cause I just like I just I felt I was, like taking a nap, and then like my mom's like, "Hey, your uh, cousins are here to see you." And I'm like, "I'm Springer." My Mexican cousins. <laughs> Mexican and cousins. then I walk outside. And I'm like, "Who the fuck are these guys?" Yeah. No, we're not interested. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah get away, Mormons. Yeah. Mormons. Yeah. <laughs> Go take your bikes over there. Did yeah. you see that? Uh, yeah, I'm not, I just walk out drinking coffee. Compilation and a with <laughs> The fuck you want? Yeah. yeah. There's a compilation video of uh, the Mormons doing jumps on their bikes. Yeah. And shit. This is, I think I just made the first uh, compilation of all the Mormons doing crazy shit on their bikes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it was pretty fucking and funny. And they get super fucked up They're on some of them. And shit all going hard. down some stairs or some yeah. shit. Like, he's like, well, if you go down these stairs and you, you come join. out good, I'll join. And they yeah. fuck themselves Show up. Show me your God. Yeah. To go over jumps or all kinds of shit. Yeah, does John Smith have your back? <laughs> John <Yeah>. Smith. <laughs> Is that, that's who Joseph. Was, right? Joseph, Joseph Smith. Joseph Smith. Yeah. Don't Mormon, use my name yeah. in vain, dog. <laughs> the Book of Mormon. Yeah. I still haven't seen it, but I heard it was a great fucking musical, actually. Well, it's because it's from South Broadway. You had to go to Broadway to watch it. Yeah. They got it off of Broadway, don't they? No, I think it's still active. It's just Broadway? 
I think the only way to see it is on Broadway. Yeah. I think it's, yeah, I think so. On Broadway. They don't like I don't think there's even a recorded version of it. Like. Really? Cuz I thought like they would just bring it to like uh the Pike's Peak Center. Like just a watch a Broadway show yeah. that would be Just watch the movie. What movie? What movie? Is it I thought the dudes from South Park made a Book of Mormon movie. Yeah, yeah. no, they made the the play. They, yeah, they literally so it's a Broadway show. I thought they I thought they had a movie though, too. I don't think so. Well, or is yeah. it just Orgasmo where they kind of do the Mormons thing? Uh, Remember the movie Orgasmo? Yeah, Orgasmo was tight. Where he's like, Remember oh, basketball? I, yeah. Well, he's like, I'm doing porn just so we can get through these things. I can have marry you. We can have our wedding. Is it just a Broadway this, play or is it an actual movie? I think this Canelo fight's about to start. Then go put it on. Wow. Where are we at in the podcast? Is the real question. Where are you at there. in the podcast, dog? Hey, your eyes are closed. Yeah, yeah, no, I watched chilling. you. I watched you fall asleep for like oh, five wait, minutes. I didn't fall asleep at all. Like we're at fifty minutes right here. But we don't need four people talking over each other. Sorry. Okay, I'll shut the fuck up then. Oh god. <laughs> Sounds like a good idea. Ozzy Osbourne. I think it's just now. giving you actual oh, Mormon oh, shit, Doug. No, this is, I looked up the musical. This is, uh, it's in New York. It's still going. Well, yeah. It is There's too. a lot of Broadway shows that are still going. We can get tickets right now for $77. Yep. And let's go bad. see Lion King on Broadway. Sounds terrible. How, yeah, how bad does a, a Broadway play have to be for you to go? Like, so, like, it's a Disney movie. You're gonna go watch a Broadway play of a Disney movie, a cartoon. There, it's it, like it's like a, a reenactment of Cats if it's Lion King, right? I mean, sure. Cats and Hamlet mixed. Why not? Yeah. What the fuck is this? I think so, right? That's a location. That's so a they name. do it. They do it uh, overseas, I guess too. Mm, makes sense. I guess there's no way to watch it though. Online. Okay. Oh, maybe you can't watch it online. It says uh, you have to pay for it. Yeah, you got so you can do like a pay per view thing of it. Is there? Uh, That's pretty tight. Maybe there, we should do that sometime. Are there European Mormons? I'm sure. I got I an equivalent. Sure there's, do you think oh, there's European it, Mormons? There's Mormons all over the world. So I, I thought it started. It, start, was it, was a, a, oh. it was a. It was a U.S. started fucking religion, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm sure. Like, there's just religion goes everywhere. Though. Like Scientology is probably everywhere. Well, Scientology is a big Be- one because it's Buddhist, just like yeah. Christianity is everywhere. Well, you're naming well, those are the old school ones, but I'm saying uh, like Scientology is like it's famous because of uh, celebrities. Yeah, Tom Cruise and fucking R. Kelly. <laughs> R. Kelly, <laughs> I think Wait, you're talking R. Kelly about was uh, a Scientologist. Yeah, it's the South Park. Episode. What's his name? Um, <laughs> <laughs> who's the one? Wasn't Will uh, Smith a Scientologist? Uh, he is. Yeah. And they were talking about how he, the Scientology is showing you how to smack someone in order to show disrespect. Yeah, they got Mormon. Oh, shit it was a, it. it was Scientology kind yeah, of. Yeah, they like, did the yeah. smacking thing, and like they would do it. It would be a public smacking. Yeah, to show if somebody dis- different. Yeah. Uh, if somebody, if you didn't like somebody or some shit. Yeah. <laughs> Who's the? There's the, the big one that does uh, Greece. John Travolta. John Travolta. Yeah. He's been in it. I since. thought he got out. No, he's no. been. In, he's been. He's, he's deep. Well, deep they take care of you if you're like a big celebrity like that. Yeah. They take care of you. I guess they assign like a team of people to like do your bidding, basically. Yeah. And your favorite dude, that's the comedian. I forget. He's a Scientologist too. Jason. Uh, uh, the one that Cruise. does the. Um, uh, uh, my name is Earl guy. He's a. Uh, uh, he's a. Uh, he's a Scientologist. He's, out. The Hispa- yeah. his, he's a Hispanic he's dude that does he's the out. narrating on Ant Man and. Uh, Oh, uh, uh, he's a Scientologist? Yeah. Who? Uh, uh, the one that's on... Michael uh, Pena? Yeah, Michael, Michael Pena. Yeah, he's a Scientologist. He's a Scientologist. Yeah. 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 Oh, he is. Yep. dude. Yep. Man, that right. makes me lose a lot of respect now. Yeah. I love that dude. Yep. Fuck. He's a Scientologist. You know who else yep. they got, too, is Dougie Fresh, dog. What? Oh, wow. Yeah, they got I didn't Dougie know that one. Yeah. Yeah. I, I was like, I know who Michael Pena is, though, yeah. He's like... I'm about to hit Joe. You don't know Dougie Fresh at We can switch speaks. Beatboxer, uh... The inventor of beatboxing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, for sure, Dougie Fresh. Snoop Dogg <laughs> and Dougie Fresh, that. right? Um, no, what's no. On? What? Didn't Snoop well, obviously Dogg? he yeah. needed he needed Scientology because. <laughs> <laughs> didn't Snoop Dogg do Fresh something with Dougie Fresh? Icon. It was, I'm the, sure Brit- it was oh. the British dude that he uh, did stuff with. Slick Rick. Yeah, Slick yeah, Rick. Slick Rick. Yeah. 
But fucking Sorry guys I don't know who that is Dougie they also, you don't know who Slick Rick is? I know who Slick Rick is I don't know who Dougie Fresh is you If you If you heard The song that he The Dougie oh, Fresh song you, I'm pretty sure You'd know I, I mean sure. Honestly if he's a Scientologist I would want to forget No 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 <laughs> It's not the fact that you know That he's a Scientologist <laughs> like Pages, That sucks I, yeah, look that up. Look that. I don't. I want to make Michael sure. Michael Pena. I feel like you guys yeah, are fucking. He is, dude. Oh, go ahead. My, yeah, Michael. I did lose a lot of respect when I saw Hot Ones and Paul Rudd was on it and he was eating <laughs> cauliflower. <laughs> He's like, oh yeah, he did cauliflower like, as a, a fucking. Bitch. I liked you. Hot Wings. He used to be America's sweetheart, and now he's. Since two thousand, just wants to eat what he wants. Shut up, dude. Shut up. Gonna cry about what take, another man eats. Take your hair out of a fucking Fuck, hair tie. Dude, that sucks balls. God damn it. Yeah, I want to write him like, hey, yeah. man, I'm just trying to convince you. I was you looking at a shit. list of science. Join any other religion. Lottie Dottie is Dougie Fresh and Snoop Dogg, right? Oh, I've heard that song. Yeah. Uh, no, uh, or like, no, Dougie no, Fresh is the first one that did Lottie Dottie, and then Snoop Dogg redid yeah, that. Yeah, and then Snoop Dogg did it with Slick yeah. Rick. Yeah, like in the because he's like, I'm gonna put on my new Gucci underwear. Yeah, yeah, he's the one that does the whole. Yeah, and like I can't do it the same way, of course. It's but he all does the because whole shit of you. I'm feeling sad and blue. Yeah, that's that old school shit. Doc. Yeah, that sucks, dude. I'm sad about it's that. Two little guys. Yeah. Yeah, Put you, know. you in your eye out. But I used to do you be think sad. It's like, sorry. No, go ahead. Do you think it's like a, the whole Mormonism thing? Because like, I know people that uh, would join the Mormon faith just because, uh, yeah, because like, they would actually pay your rent and shit. But well, like, you, you pay you, into it too. You, yeah, you would like end up living in a certain yeah. place, like depending well, on where you're at, and then like you, you give them like a certain percentage of your entire fucking check. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, like, most but of these people... Oh, shit. Goddamn. But that wasn't a thing, though. This is I, Dougie Fresh. Yeah, that's yeah, Dougie so Fresh. He, he's showing, you guys are yeah, watching the same it's shit. almost the same uh, video, yeah. But, uh... No, I have this this buddy. He's, uh... He was in the Mormon faith. And he didn't pay anything into it. And they would help him out with his, like, his utilities, his rent. So he worked for them, then? Well, but there's he, a- he, All he would do was go to the church... And he would like play and like okay, I guess he would because he would recruit people. There I guess you go. That, but he wasn't CB4. he wasn't on the clock or anything. You remember the beginning? No, of he CB4? was a recruiter. But he wasn't on the clock. With he, Chris Rock, he didn't like if he did if he didn't get oh, anybody, it wouldn't be a thing. CB four, oh, yeah, MC yeah. Gusto, yeah. I don't know. Mormonism stupid. Uh, Scientology stupid. Well, most religions, if you go go to them, they'll help you out if you're well, saying that. That's you're what uh, yeah, I mean, pay your. Uh, Tithes are or whatever. Yeah. So when you're in a church, you donate, right? Yeah. But I know a lot of people, like, sometimes... I, well, I'm pretty sure we talked about this before. No. Something will happen, like, to you, and if you're part of the church community, they'll actually take care of you because of, yeah. like, you've donated money, so they might help you out financially oh. in a way, and the the church com- like uh, community will come together to help pay. Yeah. Like, so you got some kind of medical bill or some kind of disaster. I got yeah. something for you that I thought was the craziest shit I've ever seen. I it, for my job I installed at this this house right. It was a church. And uh, a the guy that the guy didn't pay for his kitchen, the church paid for his kitchen. What the oh fuck? yeah. For yeah, so he got a free free kitchen uh, of what Tax I free. do. I'm not gonna say what I do, but out of what I do. Yeah. And he got it all for free from really? the church because just because his wife worked there and they're like and it was mm-hmm. uh it was a good faith gesture apparently. Uh-huh. They might be uh, predominant members or something. No. Or, you know, like I said, some kind of financial thing came up or so. I don't know. I remember There's I no financial thing when it comes to <laughs> having your kids remodeled. That religious comedian that I remember one time, he was talking about how he was like, oh, I pray that I get this new bike. And he's, that's not how it works. He's like, oh, okay, so I stole the bike and then I prayed for forgiveness. <laughs> that's I it. Mean. <laughs> It's like, oh, that's a good loophole. Yeah. Well, he says, I stole it, and then I just asked for forgiveness. Oops, my bad. Well, oh. I mean, yeah, that's, that's the biggest loophole, right? Yeah. That's why it's bullshit. It's like, you can do whatever the fuck you want, and all you oh. gotta do is say sorry right at the end, and yeah. you're good, right? Well, that's how people in jail are. They always turn to, they either still stay bad, or they turn to religion. 
Yeah. And they get super religious. Yeah, it's like, well, we, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's and fine it, to me. Like, if you need it like that, it. if you need it like that, that's cool. Whatever. You know what I mean? You do your thing. As long as you're not hurting anybody, whatever. Like, people need religion and shit all the time. But, like, when you start pushing it and doing all this other bullshit, it's like, come on, bro. Like, go yeah. fucking be a piece of shit somewhere else. Well, it's when they push it on oh. other people. Oh, that's right. that's where it gets to the point. It's like you can still be religious, just don't push your religious <laughs> views on me. Yeah, because well, I don't care. Yeah. It's hilarious because uh, you know they'll tell you they don't want you to push things on them. Though they're the same people who show up to your fucking house on a Saturday morning, bothering yeah. the fuck out of you. Right. Yeah. When was the last time somebody showed up at your door talking about the gay agenda? Because it doesn't fucking happen. <laughs> gay like, agenda. Yeah. It's just it, all over social media. It's fucking like. These religious people will fucking do, do exactly do what they Do windows count as a gay agenda? Yeah, windows? Yeah, I get that a lot. Window world. Like you there. look like you need new windows on your house. Or roofing. Oh, fuck yourself. I'm sure. Or, oh my I, God. We're in the area doing security systems on other people's houses. Can we talk to you about security systems? Oh, man, I love... I, I just be fucking them fools right the fuck off my property. <laughs> and then when the religious people show up, I just tell them I'm an atheist. They definitely turn away right away. Every time uh, the sales people come to my house, I just say I just say the homeowner is not here, and they just leave. It works every single time. Really? Every single time. They never Unless it's a the religious people, because then they're like, "Well, would you like to pray, brother?" No. <laughs> no. No. Go fuck yourself. Do you know are they Hulk Hogan too, or games. what? I'm playing video <laughs> games too. It's Hulk Hogan shows up to Joe's door. He's like, you want to pray with me, brother? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's like, he said, "It's Hulkamania, brother." <laughs> I think you mean Jesus mania, brother. Yeah. You know, Jesus loves you. He's like, no, my cousin Jesus hates the shit out of me. Like, Hol- holy mania, brother. I want to talk to you about the ring, my brother. The ring of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he, said, he said, you better get ready for the Holy Trinity. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, brother. <laughs> They're taking the championship belt this yeah. weekend on Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> Reminds me of that meme when the guy goes, "Do you know Jesus loves you?" And he's like, "I he does." Yeah. He's like, "Hey, Jesus, this yeah. guy says you love me," and he and Jesus just looks at him like, mm, "No." <laughs> so cold, right, so cold. Joke. Jesus is about to open up a can of whoop ass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. A whoop ass. Yeah. He opens he's up you know. two <laughs> bottles of communion wine. Yeah. <laughs> and just he's a, so when I see uh, the devil yeah. on Sunday night, yeah. <laughs> you tell the devil on Monday night. I'm going to whoop his ass. I'm going to ride him long and hard like a Texas <laughs> rattlesnake. <laughs> Captain Insano shows no mercy. JR's all in the corner. By God, I swear. <laughs> yeah, he says, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Uh, Fuck. And then King uh, says, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. That's what he says. No, nah, I don't know. King, King would say something different. He'd say something about puppies, I'm sure. He's still right? alive? Is King still alive? Yeah. I think he... I think he just wrestled not too long ago, actually, too. That dude's got to be 80. He's old as fuck. He's got to be 80 now, dude. I don't know, but... He was old when I was watching wrestling, and I was in the Attitude Era. I mean, he I know he's old as dicks now. That's for damn sure. NWO? But I don't know how old. Huh? NWO era? Can you claw me there, brother? Claw? Yeah. Oh, which one? Yeah, yeah brother. <laughs> it's just gross, Remember? dude. Yeah, whatever. These actually aren't that oh. bad. Oh, and they're eight percenters. Yeah. Surge. Yeah, I'm right. Allegedly. Allegedly. Brother. The official allegedly sponsor. Of <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh-huh. you can't, I signed us up to get sponsorships. Nothing. It's it's all fucking ad brokers, basically, dude. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, uh, let me actually look at that. Maybe there might be... What's it called? I'll sponsor you for free. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, somebody, uh, a local business I was telling them I do a podcast, they're like, uh, oh, you want to sell my business now? I'm like, well, not, I mean, for money. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, one of those things. Like, 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 local, it's cool. Yeah. They didn't, they're like, oh, well, I'm hooking you guys up. I'm like, you're not hooking me up. You're hooking the place I work for. Yeah. So It's like, I help you, you help me. Well, funny thing about my back is it's located on yeah, my back. It's, yeah. it's all on my cock. Yeah. And the What's only- the fuck? I have a urging, or a throbbing pain on my cock, and yeah. your mouth is the only thing that will solve that pain. I need a total high five with your throat. Yeah, that sounds right. Yeah, that sounds right. Well, that's how another. I, co- that. I had one of those companies start like that. It's like, oh, I help you, you help me, and we're, we'll be together. I don't have. I don't have. Go one. get a go get a beer, dude. You're. 
I don't particularly want to get up. I see you sleeping over here, dog. I'm not sleeping. He's I'm just so high, this. he looks like he's Asian. I am pretty high, though. That's for sure. I got stoned on the way here, too. Did you? And I'd still so be smoking if I wanted to. A lot of people one. throwing rocks at you? Is that where you're stoned? What? Uh, yeah. what? Yeah, what are you, Muslim? Yeah, were you trying to drive a car and you're a woman? No. Huh? Yeah. Huh? I don't know, but y'all are as funny as you think women are. So, yeah, that's there you true. Go. If I someone throws rock, <laughs> if someone throws that rocket, was actually really good. Yeah. I don't think women are funny. Yep, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> if someone throws rock with rocks I, at you while you're on your donkey, are you considered be, stoned off your ass? I know women in real life. Watch that yourself. Are actually funny. <laughs> <laughs> like women what that is I know. Going on. We're having like 18 different conversations yeah. right now. I'm just What's saying, that? like. Actually, women that I know personally are hilarious. Personal I like trying to watch yeah. a stand up, and I'm like, I don't know about this. Why is this not funny to me? A lot I of, want it to be. Uh, now, now, Whitney Cummings, I think she's pretty funny. Yeah, uh, she's Nikki not Glazer too bad. Is pretty yeah. funny. Nikki, cool. La- she's real sexual though. I think. Yeah, though. I think. Yeah. I mean, yeah. like, I don't, I don't like uh, dude comedians talk about their dicks. Uh, yeah, that Nick, shit's weird. Nikki but, Glazer yeah. does the typical female yeah. comedy. But I heard her say funny shit. Yeah, Michael she Chandler, Ellie Wong, I think is yeah. uh, kind of funny too, though. But uh, Miss Pat, I think I would say is probably one of the top females that's funny. Yeah, Miss Pat. Miss Pat, yeah. Andy Letterman is fucking hilarious. Just yeah, she's, yeah, she's, too. yeah. So like Whitney Cumming, Cummings, Annie Letterman, and uh, Miss Pat, I would say is probably one of the couple of the top ones. Probably it, Whitney Cummings is the funniest female. Just yeah, as Whitney fuck. Cummings is alright. Christina P is pretty funny too, but the, it's just funny. it's just no, weird wrong. though because I feel like she's wrong. like she's just because that's that's your opinion and you're wrong with your opinion. <laughs> yeah, you're but, entitled to your wrong opinion. It's okay. I, I, I always been, like, kind of cool with her, though, but it's just weird because she'd be, like, super kind of like how Tom Segura is. Like, she's kind of, like, like pick up, up, she, she's almost like she's she's ethnic, but she's not at the same time. Like, she'd be like, <laughs> what's up, dog? Or, okay, fool. Like, she'll say yeah. something like that, and it's, uh, like, it's funny to she's me. cultured. It's, yeah, she's cultured. So it's, like, she's cool, like, by saying that, but she's yeah. super foreign, like, because what her parents are, like, uh, immigrants, too. Yeah. Is it from, like... Her- She's just part Russian, I think, right? It's not no. Russian. It's a uh, Turk. No, it's not I'm pretty sure she's Russian. She was speaking she's Russian. She's not Russian. No, she was literally just speaking Russian on the podcast. No, I was she, listening no, to her. No, she's not Russian. She's. It's something like that, though. It's, for it's sure. like you're. Is it kind Daniel, of like Ukraine? Daniel, Daniel you. It's something. I think oh similar to that. It it's the craziest yeah. knockout ever. <laughs> Holy shit, dude! Watch that yeah, knockout, I dude. Who get, who gets a front kick like that? Yeah. Holy shit. But Dude, still, he though, slapped him. Oh my God! Look I, at this. I felt kind of awkward when I oh. first was introduced to Christina P, and I'm like, Michael she's kind of different. The fact that she's like ethnic like that, but she's cool because it's like she doesn't act like she's black, but she's <laughs> cool with it. <laughs> I love that. Thing, yeah. Love that. What the fuck? Uh, sorry, Josh, man. I'm just watching. This. I'm watching this fight, dude. Yeah, that was the crazy. That's one of the craziest front knockouts of the year so far. Right Michael Chandler chin. does a front kick to Tony Ferguson, knocks him out. Cold. He's still laying down, dude. He's, he's like, it's the y'all want to see a dead body meme all over. Again, dude. <laughs> yeah. You know how many fucks I give with that? Oh, uh, hopefully all of them, dude. Zero. You don't like fighting? You don't like guys pooping on each other? <laughs> pooping on each other is different than fighting, but, you know. All right. <laughs> no. Girls poop pooping. fighting, and then it's just retards. Girl, <laughs> girls pooping on a Poop glass table. Yeah. Can I hit that, dude? Yeah. No, you can't hit that. Oh, my God, dude. That Suck was the craziest knockout kids. ever. Suck it um, Canelo Good is problems. about to start fighting, and do we got predictions for that? Canelo gonna win. I'm gonna have to go for Canelo, dude. He's fighting Dimitri Bivol. I don't even know the other guy's name, so I'm just gonna go Canelo. Yeah. Bivol, he's a he's quick, dude. Well, he's fast. Out. Canelo gets knocked out in like. He's the white dude I'll that's Hispanic. Round. Yeah. I like, say Canelo in the sixth. Via uppercut. Yo, Rogan. Canelo in the sixth for sure. They're walking out right now. I'm about to put that on. Then go put it on, bud. Do we just want to end this or what? <laughs> we can. What yeah. time is it? I'm uh, it's about uh, we're at 108. 108. Yeah. 108. We can end it. That's fine with well. me. Pretty much talked about mostly everything. Oh, didn't you want to talk about the? What was the other thing that you wanted? 
Oh, we already talked about Chappelle then. Dave Chappelle yeah. getting tackled. He handled it. Oh. He actually handled it better than Chris yeah. Rock handled getting slapped. The fact that Chris Rock came out, though, he's like, is that Will Smith that came yeah. at you? Wow. And then Chappelle's like, it was a trans man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> trans man? Luckily, that motherfucker, was, or that, you know, that motherfucker was clumsy as fuck. Hey, yeah. do you know what kind of shoes uh, kidnappers wear? Well, I was waiting for this. Uh, <laughs> sneakers. Nope. No, that's ninjas. That's ninjas. Sorry. What kind of shoes do kidnappers wear? What? White vans. Uh, uh, yeah, see, I wait till the end of the episode to do a dad one. joke. Okay? You, got the, you got the what kind of shoes do ninjas wear? It's sneakers. sneakers. Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's what I was thinking. Well, what kind of shoes do uh, artists wear? Sketchers. <laughs> It's <laughs> <laughs> so gay. Right? <laughs> so stupid. Actually, I had a dude at work actually give me a book of dad jokes. There's like 500 of them. Josh is just sitting there oh. every night studying, studying the <laughs> fucking shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah say, your, say your owl joke, dude. Oh, uh, what kind of. Oh, what is. What do you call an owl that uh, does magic tricks? Houdini. Poop trick. Houdini. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the other one that I had was the knock knock joke. Is like knock knock. And you go, who's there? Said Yoda. Yoda who? Yoda, weirdest person I know. Okay, everybody, Yoda. introducing Josh's one hour long <laughs> dad jokes. Wap, wap, uh, wap, wap. Josh, do you want to say anything before we get out of here? Not you really. Hype anything up? Nope, I no. have nothing to hype up right now. All right. Um, nada, nada, limo, nada. You want to be on the show? <laughs> Shut the fuck up. All okay. right. If you want to be on the show, email us at uh, smoothiepod. Dot or no, not dot, that, at that, gmail.com. That, that, that. Sorry, guys. Smoothiepod at gmail.com. Yeah. Uh, follow us on... F- follow us. <laughs> God damn, dude. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, yeah. every social media you can. Yep. Um, me. Core, there's going to be a giveaway. I've been seeing some of the prizes and shit. Yeah. Pretty sick. Yeah, Marcus, tell us about uh, Nerdcore real quick. Hey, what nerd? What am I supposed to tell you? What's what's up with that? What did what did Daniel just say? I mean, always? I got a giveaway coming up. Oh, I got a fucking big expensive giveaway coming what up. What do they right gotta now. do for that? Is that just you just giving it away? Not nothing yet, cause it ain't going anywhere yet. I'm just hyping it up. All right, I like that. Actually, that's all that is right now is hype. I all got right. I got a dark one though. This is uh, what it. <laughs> <laughs> what is it called when nobody uh, asked for this? Oh, what is it called when a cop uh, shoots a ginger? I've seen that. Uh, it's uh, orange is the new black. Exactly. Uh, uh, and I'm then is this? No more is, jokes. Yeah. Is uh, that dad joke rape? Hit like me up on Twitter, Instagram, officialjobro.com. Thank you guys. We'll be back. Yeah, I'm done with pro on Instagram or no Twitter. I don't know. That's the only one I kind of look at now. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I want to talk oh, about him. Hold up, hold up. Eerie, <laughs> eerie. <laughs> Scratch that, rewind it. I mean, it was pretty. Uh, okay, so, damn, that's weird. We already did it pretty much. Ah, uh, you can end it. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, he bought it, that's cool. Levels are freaking out. They want him to fucking appear before Congress. The fact that it's 9% for him to buy 9% in order to own most of the company. They already bought 9%. But that's what yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, he owns all, all, all of them. Is it all? Yeah. Well, I thought he it was made like, it a private company. You know, like but the fact company. that nine percent is what took it to be able to do that. I, like, I think it's crazy how people are freaking out. That They're like oh, this is, you know, he wants a free speech. Like, stop suppressing everything. Even hate speech is free speech, right? The people that are fighting. He said so, he said he wants to have freedom of speech as long as it's in the constitution. Like, he's yeah, just no the threats. same thing as you. It was a comedian on Twitter, and it was saying that all the people that own Teslas, it was a comedian, I can't remember, I'm sorry, I forgot your name, you probably won't hear this, uh, <laughs> all the, they said that all the people that own Teslas are the ones that are mad about Elon buying Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right? Pretty much. You can't afford gas, but-